Hello all, myself Dr. Ranjana Khade from Department of Microbiology, Seva Sudans, R.K. Tarleja College, Ullas Nagar, affiliated to Mumbai University. My topic for presentation is treatment of wastewater and electricity generation using microbial fuel cells. Because of increase in the industrialization uh, has raised and two issues on global level and these are pollution and energy crisis. As per the CPCB, per day almost 38,354 million liters of wastewater is released into the environment. Now this released wastewater is responsible for water pollution and posing a great threat on the aquatic life. So from this wastewater, one can uh, obtain the energy by using microbial fuel cells as it represents an eco-friendly approach for not only obtaining the renewable uh, energy but it can also result in the degradation of uh, pollutant from the wastewater. A microbial fuel cell is a device that converts chemical energy to electrical energy and this could be achieved because of the catalytic action of microorganisms. Microbial fuel cells consist of an anode, cathode, a proton or a cation exchange membrane. Microorganisms which are responsible for degrading the pollutant which are present in the wastewater. As a result of this catalytic action, uh, it results in the release of electrons. Now, this electrons released uh, by the microorganism they can be transferred from anode to the cathode and there is a uh, circuit is completed which result in the generation of the electricity now because of this property microbial fuel cell represent an promising way for generation of electricity along with degradation and management of wastewater coming from different industries like food beverages, textile, agro-based industries. This microbial fuel cells represent a promising way for reduction in the uh, BOD, COD value of the wastewater. Many researchers have already reported the role of microbial fuel cells in the generation of the electricity uh, along with reduction in the COD value. The wastewater treatment using microbial fuel cells represent a competitive way as compared to existing method. Hence, the present work was based on construction of microbial fuel cells using indigenous exoelectrogenic flora from polluted water for generation of the electricity along with degradation of the wastewater. Methodology. The sample collection was carried out from Ullas River from Thane district, Maharashtra. You can clearly see the health of this particular river because this river is receiving uh, polluted water from many uh, small industries. Now, this polluted water uh, playing important role in affecting the quality and the aquatic life associated with this river. Hence, the wastewater was collected and it was analyzed for its uh, pollution level with respect to uh, total solids, dissolved solids, suspended solids, salinity, hardness along with BOD and COD value as per the APHA method. The cost effective microbial fuel cell construction was carried out in the laboratory by using two plastic jars as anode and cathode chamber. These two chambers are separated by a salt bridge. Anode chamber uh, basically represents an anaerobic chamber, uh, whereas in the cathode chamber, aerobic conditions main, are maintained. For uh, detection or measurement of the electricity, multimeter is used. Uh, now, this microbial fuel cell constructed in the laboratory condition is used uh, for formation of the biofilm and the microorganisms from the wastewater are allowed to form the biofilm on the anode surface 
anode and cathode are formed by using aluminium mesh now to support the biofilm formation uh, the anode chamber is filled with waste water uh, for as a source of microorganisms and sodium thioglycolate was added to maintain the anaerobic condition uh, whereas glucose was added to support the growth and biofilm formation the biofilm formation was allowed to uh, allowed to develop for 10 days and after 10 days the anode chamber was then replaced with waste water and this uh, treatment of the waste water is then carried out for 10 days and during this 10 days the electricity generation was observed now during this 10 days the mark reduction in the pollutant level of the waste water was detected with respect to total solids total dissolved and suspended solids uh, while uh, with respect to incubation period increase in the electricity generation was observed on 10th day the electricity generated was found to be 300 millivolts Uh, during incubation the mark reduction in the cod value was also observed though the reduction in the bod was not that prominent as compared to cod value thus microbial fuel cells represent a promising technology for generation of the electricity along with degradation of pollutant content in the waste water now this technology represent a multidisciplinary eco friendly approach for uh, uh, for renewable energy sources along with waste water management these are the few references uh, which helped uh, during the methodology and construction of microbial fuel cells thank you